In girls basketball, Canton's Allison Wheeler reaching a scoring milestone. She scored the 1,000th point of her career on Saturday, and she still has another year of high school hoops ahead of her. The junior is Canton's leading scorer and perhaps the team's leading baker. She loves to bake and says it's something that keeps her going when she's not playing basketball. Everyone knows she can score, but evidently not everyone in Canton knows that she bakes. There are several people from Canton that do like to bake that have shared their cookies with us. I did not know Allison was one of them. It's kind of something to take my mind off basketball, you know. I like to stay balanced and just do other things and baking has really helped me and plus you get some good treats out of it. <laughs> yep, you get sweet treats out of the deal. We've got more with Allison Wheeler and a full story that you'll find at our website, ciproud.com. Just click on local sports. Boys hoops in the middle line eye conference on Thursday. League co-leader uh, Metamora playing at Pekin. Good ball movement here by the Redbirds. They find Tyler Mason open. He's going to knock down a three from the wing. But Jeremy Crouch's Pekin Dragons played very well. Down double digits. They shoot the three to get back into the game. Tyler Filarski from that corner and then Daniel Cash from the wing on the other side. And we've got ourselves a ball game that Metamora hangs on to win. Matthew Zorba scores 14 to lead the way. Here's one of his threes. Metamora hangs on for a 45-42 win over the Dragons. Middle line game in East Peoria where Washington comes to visit the Raiders and Quentin Kitt goes to Jackson Aaron underneath for a nice East Peoria hoop. Final seconds of the first half, it's Andre Lewis with a pull-up jumper for the Panthers here. Washington trailed at halftime but dominates the second half off the Lewis miss. It's a James Johnson offensive rebound and put back part of a 52-37 Washington win.